Hello readers and writers, welcome back to my channel. I'm author ER Reading and today I'm going to cover what I was able to accomplish the first month into the quarter. So in this video I'm going to talk about what systems have been supporting me this quarter, Q2, uh, and how I've been able to thrive and certain tasks that I've been able to accomplish. So if you're new to this channel, I will go over a little bit what I do to support myself during a quarterly planning system. So I use a Kanban board, which I will show you in a second, uh, and I actually added a Kanban board section for my admin tasks this quarter, which was very new, but I'm loving how it turns out, so let's take a look at those things. First up is my Kanban boards, and I am very happy with how this is going. I have several tasks down at the bottom, um, and I mean, I have quite a few still left at the top, but I'm only one month in, so I think I'm doing great. Um, I did something different this quarter. Instead of just having one big Kanban board with my three goals, I added my admin onto a separate Kanban board, which has been working so much nicer and I'll explain why. Uh, but this has my, all my videos, my posting, my email, my everything like that. And then these are all my writing tasks, my school, my mental and physical health. So the reason that this separate admin is working is because it's helping me separate um, my tasks, my to do, my author to do's rather than my writing tasks. And this has been working really well. I'm really happy to say that I'm much more consistent. Uh, I've been spending less time on social media. I've been able to get more writing done. Uh, and so I think it's working really, really well. And I'm really happy with it. And I think it's going to continue to work throughout the quarter. All right, so I've got my second tool here. Uh, and it's actually my planner. Uh, and I'll take you on top view in just a second, but I've been using this planner for two quarters now. This is my second quarter with it, and I am in love with it. It is amazing. It's everything I want in a planner, um, and so I use this for planning out my tasks, my goals, and everything else in, and then I have a few other planners. Uh, you've probably seen, if you've seen my planner lineup video, I will link that down below. Uh, I show you all the planners that I've, um, put into place for me to use this quarter this year actually but i did end up getting a new planner for my um social media goal it was 90 percent off because it was mostly um the first part of the year but i needed one that went through until december and so it will work brilliantly i'm very excited about it uh, but i will show you that another day first off i'm going to show you how i do my review so this is my open planner, and in here it has a monthly review set out for you after each month in the quarter. And it kind of goes over, like, um, what major projects did you accomplish, and um, what tasks didn't get done, and are you on track, and things like that. And it just goes through, and I'm going to fill all of these out, and that will give me a good idea if I'm actually on track, as on track as I think I am. So I've just finished filling this out and I'm going to talk through some of these things um, and how they really helped me. Alright, so some of the major projects that I said that I had completed were finishing edits on Soul Chaser and getting it off to the editor, which was a huge deal at the beginning of this quarter. Um, and I established good routines, regular posting, uh, I read five plus books. Um, I was good with my school and so that all played into having a successful first month in the quarter. I did have some struggles but I've been able to uh, figure out ways to manage through them. Now as a person that struggles with 
anxiety, uh, it can be heightened through many things, many triggers, um, and so I've been able to try and figure out how to manage that better this quarter and be able to work with and around it, um, and that has definitely helped. I definitely think that the admin board helped me lower my social media time uh, as well as changing some time limits on my phone which is really helpful if you're ever struggling with your social media right on your phone you can set your own time limits of start finish length of time and that definitely has helped me uh, be more mindful I am mostly on track to get my goals done however I do not have my manuscript back from the editor it's taking a little bit longer than planned so my beta readers got pushed back so that is one thing that I am off time for but I can't change anything about it I just have to um, work with it and as soon as I get that manuscript back going through it completely sending it off to beta readers and that will be um, quite a quick process hopefully now I love what she uh, talks about in this HB90 planner, um, how you should reward yourself for um, things that you've done really well on, and these rewards can be very personal. Um, I haven't decided on the rewards I would like yet, however I will go ahead and fill that in in a little bit, and then I will give myself those rewards. Rewards can be um, anything to watching TV, to getting a uh, new set of washi or anything like that, and they are really motivating for me. If you watch my NaNoWriMo diaries, you definitely saw that I gave myself rewards, uh, daily rewards, goal rewards, all the, all the good stuff. <laughs> One of the other challenges I mentioned that I faced um, I actually just made a vlog about it was my last video um, and it was about getting back into my NaNoWriMo project um, project angel and that was definitely a bit of a struggle to figure out um, character arcs and everything that I needed to change after sitting on it so long I knew that things weren't quite right with it so I definitely have a better vision of that now and that was definitely a challenge for this first month in the quarter but um, I did overcome that challenge and I'm still writing new words on this um, project while I wait for edits on Soul Chaser. If you are considering using a quarterly system or considering using the HB90 system or any goal-oriented system, leave questions for me down below. I would love to answer them to the best of my abilities. I love planning and I love sharing my joy of planning, so please, any questions, just let me know or you can ask me in my DMs on Instagram uh, that I'll link also down below. But that'll be pretty much it for me, a successful month for the beginning of the quarter, uh, and I will see you next video, which is next week. Uh, please do subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you won't miss any of my videos when they're put out, and I will see you guys soon. Bye!